We're here with Pop Ellie, Jeff Young husband, Tony Tucker, and Doug Jones. And uh, first, we want to start off by uh, saying that you guys been just past the two-year mark being together, and uh, you, you guys also toured last summer across Canada as far as uh, Kitchener, Ontario. What, what was that experience like? It was, you know, good time. A lot of uh, good experiences, a lot of bad experiences. You know. It was a pretty good time, though. Well, all in all, it tightened the band up a lot. You know, we you know got to play around, get our sound out to a few other people, and you know we got some positive feedback from it. So you know, that's the most important thing. Uh, was it hard to organize? Would you would you try something? It's a big venture, I know, picking up and and going halfway across Canada and back. Would you would you guys do it again? And if so, how would you do it differently? I get somebody else to do all the telephone calls. <laughs> big phone sure. bill. Spent a lot of money on phone calls trying to set it up. So I guess I'd get somebody else to do it, but I'd definitely do it again. Okay, well, the, you guys have been together two years, and the uh, the alternative scene here in St. John's has, uh, to put it mildly, exploded. Uh, how have you guys, uh, have you guys noticed a big change in the past two years? Uh, the crowd's been getting bigger and more enthusiastic? Yeah, Doug will feel that one. <laughs> uh, yeah, the crowd's been getting bigger for the last couple of years. When we first started, like, there was, you know, 15 people will come see us at Fire None and stuff. But uh, now we've turned, you know, there's like 200 people at just about every show. People seem to dig what we're doing, so... Yeah, well, the place place was certainly packed tonight. Uh, how do you guys find the uh, All Ages show that you played tonight? Uh, how do you find those uh, differ from the regular shows? The kids, uh, I, th I think the kids don't really like the place. They like the hall a lot better, I think. Yeah. But, like, the All Ages shows, like, in general, they're a lot more fun because they're, like, a bunch of kids who have a lot of energy who don't usually get to go out on the weekends and stuff, and we're giving them somewhere to go, and so, you know, they come down, they go crazy, have a good time. There's really good energy and stuff. It's a lot of fun to play to it. So we don't play many bar shows anymore. We try and play as many All Ages shows as possible. And sort of, you know... Are they uh, harder to organize, or how do you find... Uh they're a bit harder to find like uh, venues for it just because people are like, you know, bars like this, like they went through a lot of trouble here to get it like possible to have all ages shows in this place and uh, they, have to bar they have to put wood blocks over their bar so that you can't see the liquor behind it and then they open another bar for soda and stuff so, you know, it's just sort of craziness but like, you know, there's only two or three places we can do them around town so it's sort of annoying but it's getting better all the time because they have them, you know, once or twice a month here at the loft now so. You know, it's getting a lot better. Should have ripped you lip from limb. I should have torn you apart. Should have ripped you up from leg. I should have played my part. Now I'm going down. Going down, 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 down,